guys, welcome to the channel, welcome back to the channel, whichever you see today, and welcome to, welcome back to the Ultimate Tay on Rank, and we're going from beginning to most recent, in our official song, free song by song, get my thoughts and put into a list, most favorite to least favorite, what you can find in the pin and comment section below, the story so far, man, last song, Love and Colour, was absolutely stunning, like there's, I, I said in the last episode, I'll say it again, there's just been something about the last good few songs, where I felt like there was a bit of a shift in the production, and like this the genre identity that was happening with her music a little bit like very much even though of course she'd be, at, at this point she'd been doing it for ages with girls generation and everything right but it's like finding her sound um even though a lot of the you know early early songs uh the first few songs she did i mean i i, I is still probably my favorite debut in k-pop so far um after that though i think there was a bit of like finding her sound not it's finding her voice but finding the genres and what style of songs and everything like that. But there seems to be something about the last few that, I don't know, I feel like she's found that sort of identity uh, from a soulless point of view and everything. But damn. So anyway, it's time spent walking memories. Walking through memories. Yeah. Just, I don't know, I can't explain that. I tried to then, but... music when they're there. Oh, 
absolutely blown away. I'm absolutely blown away. I'm oh, very close, very close. That was stunning, man. Very close. Oh. And that was our song that, like, the first half, I thought, man, this is absolutely beautiful. And then, it, like, it didn't shift, it didn't switch or anything like that. It was still very much the same song, but it just went into, like, it went from third gear to fifth gear. But it, was, it wasn't, like, jarring or anything like that. It just came out of nowhere, though. But, I, I, but it just, it was just, I, like, I love that sort of atmospheric sound and everything like that. And, and to have, like, that crescendo moment last so long... Because that's the thing, is that those crescendo moments at the end of songs, it's very rarely, if they're built up well and they're delivered that as as great as it was with this song, it's very rarely that I'm like, oh, that went on too long. Oh, that went on too long. And, like, I was honestly, <laughs> I was honestly happy for that to go on for a minute longer because the production, the... the huh? Uh, that that voc those vocals going along with the keyboard that electric guitar that was coming in back at it, like really it was near the back of the mix but it suited it th that well it, like amazingly produced that song was um man that was stunning absolutely stunning again ne nearly brought tears to my eyes uh, still is nearly bringing tears to my eyes just thinking about that song uh beautiful chorus again uh, I'm happy to listen to this lady sing for forever, to be totally honest. But, like, what a song. What a song. It, it really made me feel. And that's the thing with music. That's music at its best for me that makes you absolutely feel. Um, and the biggest compliment I can give, I mean, I say this, guys, like, many times. There's, like, stages of goosebumps for me, right? Where, for some reason, when I start to get goosebumps, I get them on my left arm first. And then you go into stage two, right arm. Stage three is the back of the neck, back of the neck with music I'm talking about now. Back of the neck was stage three. And then the ultimate is tears. Um, and we went straight to tears. I didn't get goosebumps for some reason, but we went straight to tears. Um, near tears. Because it was just so, so, so stunning. <laughs> so stunning. Looking at my list, I start from top to bottom. Man. I don't know where this song's come from, but I just flowed by it. Flowed by it. Um, I, I, it's 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 honestly it's whether it's first or second position that may surprise people. But I I I don't know what else to say. It just really had an effect on me. It just really had an effect on me with how it sounded and its production, and obviously because I'd say no voice. I mean, I is one of the is my favorite debut in K-pop that I've heard so far, um, and it's amazing. But the thing is, I say about I all the time, guys. I prefer the um, music video version for I than the song, the the official song. And what I'm and you may be curious what I'm on about there. I'm not on about just watching it. I'm on about the the actual song itself. The music video has that amazing bridge where it kind of turns into like a soft indie rock song for a little bit. Uh, and it's the instrumental going for about 30 seconds, which really builds up and makes the song even more epic. Um, that's not in the official song, uh, which I was disappointed with. I still adore the song, of course. It is what it is for a reason. But like, if that official version had that bridge, I mean, I still could be top to be honest if that was the case um even above time lapse but it doesn't um it does you know it's a, it's shorter um so taking that into account that's why time spent walking through memories does go above i still not don't know what to do about time lapse though i, I i'll put above i i'll put above i and below time lapse something's telling me not to put it above time lapse i don't know what but something's telling me not to put her above time lapse. But yeah, I mean, that's what's great about uh, this channel for me, guys, is not having a clue. <laughs> like, when a song's gonna come out of nowhere and just hit me for six. And this one's done that. It's just, again, there's something about the production and her identity in the last few songs that's just gone up a level. Not so much the identity that's gone up a level, because she's always had an amazing identity and talent. But the sound and the production has gone up a level for me, I think. Um, 
But anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Hit that like button if you did. So that give me a great idea. You want to see more Taeyeon on the channel? And uh, let me know where it goes for you. You may not vibe with it at all. Uh, you may have vibed with it even more than I did. And uh, please subscribe because plenty of Taeyeon on the channel already in the Taeyeon Reactions playlist. Plenty more on the way. So hope you guys have a lovely rest of your day, morning, afternoon, night. Whenever you're watching this, please take care. Much